Hey guys, so I am working on my coloring um, for this sushi cat and another one of my sushi cats that I have. This one is a sea urchin cat. Um, it's based off of the sea urchin roll. Um, it was kind of hard to do the legs, to be honest. I'm just going to start coloring and kind of talk about it overall. Um, first, I'm going to color in the face, which is YR32 in my touch markers so yeah it's a deep yellow so i'm just gonna start coloring and talk about it basically it was pretty hard to figure out how the legs go especially this plush doesn't have legs on it all the other sushi cat plushes that i had had some sort of legs on it or something like paws and it was easier to kind of like get creative and think okay where are the legs how are they gonna be um this one was a bit difficult just because there's no legs showing but i still wanted there to be legs just because you know realistically cats have legs so i was like okay I'm going to do what I did for my wasabi one, which was like a wasabi roll. So underneath the seaweed, like over here, there's like those hind legs. But then for the front legs, I kind of had them poking out of the seaweed. Not as much as the wasabi cat one, just because that one had like its paws sticking out and all of that. So I just gave it the stubby legs, like the other sushi cats that I drew. All of these um, drawings are in my um, drawing playlist, if you want to go see that. But yeah, basically I have them sticking out here, just like out of the sushi a bit, but... Just more so little stubby paws, nothing, nothing too detailed. And then I have the sea urchin sushi on top. Um, I kind of didn't do the sea urchin sushi too realistic, so I just made it like a wave. Um, it's supposed to look really pretty, but that's basically how I drew it. I'm going to use YR31 just for these stripes over here on the head. Just a little bit darker brown compared to the golden brown that I used for the face of the cat. And then the last thing I'm using is y uh, GG... Um, GG9, which is a green gray, kind of like a dark seaweedy gray with some green tint to it. Don't know why my stomach is very rumbly almost every time of the day. Must be like super hungry. <laughs> but if you hear any sounds, it's my stomach. I don't know if the tablet picks up on those sounds though. So what I'm doing is I'm just going through the seaweed now, just coloring it all in. I thought I was done, but I actually have two like cat purses as well that are sushi cat purses. So. I probably will go through those and try to do drawings of them as well. Now I'm just coloring in the sea urchin on top. But yeah, I just remembered I had those as well for the sushi cat plushies that I have. So I'm gonna see if I can do drawings of them as well. Just go from there. And this butt part is just white because it's like the rice. So here's the overview of the drawing. Um, pretty simple. And then here is my sea urchin cat. 
basically you can see his face is supposed to be like a sea urchin and then here's his butt it's just white white rice and then he has his seaweed hope you guys enjoyed this video check down in the description box below all my social media is there you can go like and follow those and my next video will be for outlining this one so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video bye